Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it is an early, early morning out here. I never stream at this hour. I'm never even awake at this hour, if I'm being completely honest with you. But you know what I am? I am live right now with the Call of Duty. I was about to say Black Ops Cold War. We're done with that game. That, that game's over, son. We are live now. Ooh, ooh, the new damned though is so good. We are live right now with Call of Duty Vanguard zombies my first ever and i mean this like 100 percent. this is my first ever attempt i did not get the game early well technically i did get the game early but this is literally the first time i'm playing it i literally just finished the download for it this is going to be my my, my pure first attempt congrats ever. on your first move to new zealand thank you thank you <laughs> Pingu, you're so dumb <laughs> you're so dumb uh no call of duty actually did send me a code to do this so i didn't i didn't move to new zealand to play it early but here we go, ladies. Ooh, all pacings. I don't know what that symbol means. Solo match. I, I I really don't know what to expect. I I have been so off the internet, like in terms of this game, that I'm gonna be honest. I forgot it was coming out. I straight up forgot it was coming out. And here we are with ooh, unknown device, covenants, crafting. Okay, that was like literally a two second load time. Uh, STG 44, energy mine, frost blast, ring of fire. I mean, let's let's go with that, right? Oh boy. No, you are fired oh. for being late. I'm sorry, but it did not seem like you were using that face. Bruh. <laughs> well, the very first thing I can say is that I need to adjust my graphics interface to raise my field of view. Wait, can you I not? I am the destroyer, hero of the Nether Wars. Let us wade into battle together. Yes, Enter sir. the portals and win Black Hearts, the coin of this dark realm. There's no shot that there's no pausing. Why can I not pause in solo? Treyarch! <clears throat> okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm not gonna. No, no, no. No, no, no. It's okay. It's okay. It's a small thing. It's a small thing. Okay, what? Well, actually, though. Okay, let me run over here. We got thermite. Sure it will be useful. Coalition charge. Ammo. What kind of stuff does this drop? Is that just like a oh crystal salvage throwing knife um uh, it's it, it's probably a day one patch thing yeah maybe uh well, i was gonna change one more thing oh yeah uh interface subtitles on uh yeah let's let's turn subtitles on i want to make sure to hear everything do not hug the Zombie bears melee as my kill. father used to say do not hug the bears uh okay so this is the i guess hub world area Sacrifice hearts for covenant abilities. Ammo gremlin, stowed weapons, refill ammo. Melee attacks do more damage and heal you. Deal with more damage for shooting while stationary. And you can have three covenants and you get different hearts for completing stuff. So we have a harvest. Craft you. As you well know, this area is swarming with revenants. We just want to reassure you. I myself am quite safe for the moment. Oh, good for you. Since Great. The That's days, awesome. The artifacts have oak. For list kept me by his side. After all, I'm as close as there is to an expert on the entity dwelling within him. When we arrived here in Stalingrad, it took the locals by surprise. The last thing they expected was the Nazis to return. But von List had been here then the Germans surrendered. He wants to turn the site of their greatest loss into the source of Nazi victory. To do this, he will raise an army of revenants from the millions who perished on the Eastern Front. But to accomplish such a feat, Cortifex must first build up his strength. Von List locked me in this room with my books and the radio. I watched from my window as he called upon Cortifex to seal off this So Cortifex is the big, city. like, demon-looking guy. I know. I had to act. Once I radioed for help, I used what I learned from the Tome of Rituals. The rune magic in its pages sealed this room. Of course, I have no idea how to undo this spell, but for now, neither Von List nor his revenants can touch me here. And now that you have responded to my cry for help, we must work together. We must store their progress. What's oh, crafting Gather table over there? On Tibor Heights activities. I will continue to advise you. Oh, that looks while super I cool up there. Formulate a plan to stop them once and for all. Till then, keep 
fighting my champions. We must strengthen your demons. If we have any hope of winning. So the, the demon is our is our like artifact. So we can craft armor. Oh, so the, this table has everything now. We have a self res for three thousand. There it looks like there's only one style, I guess, of uh, a salvage. I don't even have any of this stuff unlocked. Do I have this? Oh my god! You literally have to get to level fifty three to unlock self res. Seven fifty for uh, first armor. So armor system is back. Um, I, I I mean, like style wise, I'm really really liking it so far. Is this another radio right here? Okay, we'll listen to that after we do this first thing. We got a random weapon. We got transmit, harvest, and blitz. Let's do let's do a uh, harvest. That seems like a good good one to start with. So, Sir Exus, it's time to feed. Uh, uh, are Remember, we? Artifacts won't make this easy for us. Oh, so that that's our dark ether demon right there. Okay, new objective found, harvest. containment spell slowly drains your demonic partner's energy. What, dude, what is that? Okay, you so... You can restore us by gathering runestones and putting them in the Sin Eater Obelisk. Sin Eater Obelisk. So... Headshot! The most satisfying feeling in the world. Rise, Revenants. They are taking power that belongs to me. Keep going, plaything. I can almost taste that face. So these, these dudes, these dudes actually talk like a lot. Like they are, they are giving like, you know, they are giving the lore out. <laughs> I gotta say, <laughs> they are dropping the lore on everyone's forehead right Look there. Let me, me turn that voice on. Is the, uh, wait, wait. Yeah. is the volume good for everybody? Deposit rune stones into the soul eater. Find the obelisk. It's around here. Oh, went up top. Is this a perk? Diabolical damage. Okay, so this is our first look at a perk, or a perk right here. So this just straight up does like more headshot damage. A bullet for your thoughts, comrades. Max ammo. So max ammo is like BO4. Fire Another one of these. This is really interesting the way this is like working so far. So the process to root. The city is Why can't that thing stay put? Dude, it reminds me, you know what it reminds me of? This part right here reminds me of like a Garage Crow beat. Uh, Right, no pausing. Uh, it reminds me of like a Garad Krovi. I'll keep it. Oh wow. Oh my god, I almost just died. That thing did so much damage. Leaving me alive. My only regret is that I cannot get on you twice. There we go. Oh my strength is returning. Thank you, plaything. You did well. Oh, you, I literally can a like- A battle and a meal. <laughs> you know how to show a girl a good time. Oh, and then it teleports you out whenever you're done. Huh, so well, each area seems to have its own little perk. Hands it feeds you. <laughs> get, get the perk? I mean, I, 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 I have a feeling we're gonna go back. Oh. But there are more to bring down. So that opens up a, a new area, I guess, which is, I guess, more exploration and stuff. Oh, there's, oh, there's just zombies chilling over here. So I. I think So in, no, I guess Invictor is one of the good guys as well. To see you live. I think the perks are free. The perks are free. See that Have a taste of demon blood. 
uh, ethereal haste boost move speed. So that's, oh, so that's like a level one. And then each one of these has levels. It looks like, uh, and then if I want to get it again, yeah, then it costs more. I see. Okay. So I should have, I should have just bought the, uh, the thing right off the bat. Um, hello. Are you an Easter egg? No, there is no Easter egg. Sag. Sag. Um. Oh. Oh. I mean, uh, dude, aesthetically. Fools! You came a long way just to die. Are you, are you sure about that? One shot, one so, less rep. So the zombies get, like, transmatted in, dude. Whenever Cortifax calls on him. So Cortifax is, like, the main bad guy. I, I don't know who Invictor is. Is Invictor, like, the main good guy? Like, you know, like, our our main dude who, like, progresses the, you know, what we're, what we're doing and everything? Uh, oh, I also have a heart. Let me see. Deal much more damage to the slowed or stunned enemies. Critical, critical kills return a bullet. Successive shots to enemy, same enemy do more damage. This one's purple, so I'm going to grab that one. So I, I'm now going to deal extra damage to slowed enemies. Oh, there's there's a loot thing here. One chest. Maybe you look better now. Gain and nope, bomb and never a stand. Mind. Okay, yeah, I don't want I don't want to gain and bomb. I almost killed myself with that. And then pack a punch, upgrade weapon. Oh, it's seventy five hundred for the first pack a punch. punch to your weapons. Try it. Okay, let's go to transmit. Activate portal. So each, each portal is around essentially. More allies. I have a plan for that. I'm guessing. Oh, so so I, it looks like all of the totems talk to you, not just the one that you that you have. So, huh? That floating orb will find a weak spot between dimensions. Stay close. We will protect each other. Okay, so, so this one's just like an escort right here. The, the, and, and then if I leave, is it literally like the normal escort? Like if I leave this area, does it start hurting me? Yeah, it does. Okay, so you have to like stay close enough to the orb to keep it moving. And if you go outside, you start hurting everything. Well, it's, not, it's nice to be ranking up guns. Hello? Oh, I literally have to be standing like next to it, next to it in order for it to go. Yeah, chat, I, 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 I think my plan is I'm going to be playing through this entire thing. You mortals are so easily led. Stim, let's go. And easily bled. I, I think my plan is I'm going to hold off on giving my thoughts until the very end. I think, I think that's, uh, I think that's, that's my plan. It's we're gonna we're gonna play up. through the entire thing. We're gonna we're gonna see you know as, as like get as far as I can go on the first attempt, and then give my thoughts at the very end. Is that fair? Oh, that was easy. Friends come, Belakar. None can stand against me. If we do that often enough. A friend will come to our aid. Ow, jeez, that broke my legs right there? <laughs> that was a tiny little fall. Is not worse than court effects. <clears throat> hmm. Okay. I, I, I mean, honestly, like, uh, honestly, I, I'm liking the, uh, what's it called? Um. This is craft. You have another harder. to clear. Okay, Pog, we, so we can go in this area now. Ooh, another perk. What, what is now this? Would be a good time to inspect Boost the region speed. So I now can, I now have... Like, it's kind of like Quick Revive, uh, like, leveled up. Uh, you know what I mean? It, it, uh, sh should we buy another one of these? We should probably buy some armor. How much... We, uh, we don't have enough salvage. Mm. You test my patience, mortals. Now pay the price. Yes, sir. You know I will. Your face or your ass? Hard to tell. <laughs> that voice line. 
Um. You are fools to do Christ's bidding. But once you are dead, you will answer my commands. What's down here? Ooh, this okay. This is how you make your fortune, soldier. Decoy grenade. Ooh, a decoy grenade would be kind of clutch. I'm not gonna lie. I will take it. Let's try a decoy out. Um. All right. There's a bunch of zombies over there. I guess let's just go to the next area. Uh, eh, we, oh yeah, we also need to check this. Chance to return nor uh, turn a normal enemy when shooting it. Successful shots in the same enemy deal more damage. Um. These are both all three rares. So. Thank you. Let's do deadly but accurate. Forgive me if I don't linger. Okay, and I'm gonna hit the box one time. Combat is always a roll of dice. Okay, well, that was a sniper rifle. Don't really want that. That's Go fine. All right. Oh, we're going to Shino Numa, though. Pog. I'm excited to see Sh Shino Numa. That's, that'll, that'll be good. Um. Yeah, there's no rat. This is the only zombies experience on launch, and they haven't really. They've kind of avoided the question if they're going to be doing round based or not. Vacancy over Fiora's army. Kill every revenant you see. Okay, so literally. Oh, this is just a survival one. Your raid must be brief. Make it fruitful. Victor. I, I do I do really really like the dark ether that he's talking to you so much. I still haven't used it. Should I use it here? I still haven't used a uh, ring of fire, which is one of the things. Yeah, for for the people asking my thoughts, uh, I, I am I am going to give it a full stream and then give my give my thoughts at the very very end I'm, 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 I'm gonna be streaming the whole thing and then we're gonna talk about everything and then we can oh so those are the exploding ones those are the exploding ones right there On the later rounds, this is gonna be pretty difficult, dude. Must end. You shall not leave here alive. Okay, let's, let's try this out. Here we go. I got a trophy. Wait, I wait. Ring of Fire doesn't. Take ammo from the stock? You have made a blood enemy of Oberfuhrer Wolfram for list. Good luck with that. So, Ring of Fire doesn't take That's ammo from your stock? Why, why though? Why though? <laughs> Why would it not take? Why would it not take ammo from your? Okay. Well, maybe maybe that's a bug. Cause splendid work, my ally. Maybe I don't know. Maybe we it's not a thing. It's just for balancing. I don't know. To being free. <laughs> All right. Let's see here. Well, it goes harder. So now we're on round four. I do want to get a different gun here. Oh god, they're so loud. Oh god, ow. <laughs> if only the blast made me deaf. Okay. Got some, got some big outbreak like crystal vibes and stuff like that. What, what is the new area? I guess over there. All right, so I now buy another covenant. I think it's what they're called. 
Okay. Hello. Hello. Yes, yes, yes. Stop yelling, please. Never, never yell. Oh, a little uh, thing in here. Um, I don't know what this is, but I will take we it. We will get along, you and I. Oh, I have a feeling this is going to be a good zombies gun. I just have a feeling this is going to be a good zombies gun. All right, let's see. Covenant abilities. Enemy killed by explosions have a higher chance to explode. Small chance to keep equipment. Chance to turn a normal enemy while shooting it. Um, uh, ethics. We'll get turned. Just kill and take my reward. But this is how we do it. Okay. So do I? What do y'all think? Is it worth pack a punching right now? I still can't get in there. Professor, it is time to bid your toy Ooh, this, this thing kind of. This thing kind of clapped, boys. This thing kind of... Uh, I kind of want to pack a punch. What do y'all think? We can afford to pack a punch. We can okay, so it looks like oh, and then we can also we can also afford to craft. Some, ooh, here we go. Here's perk. Fiendish fortune increases health. So that gave me 25 extra health. Okay. Uh, let's craft armor. We have armor level one done. Um, I feel like it's worth it to spend a little bit of points on this. Increase health again. You could use it. So that gives you, so every time you bought you upgrade it, it gives you 25 more uh 25 more health uh okay i'm gonna go ahead and pack punch this That's my answer to everything. wait is there no pack a bunch camo is that coming in day one patch wait why is there no pack a bunch camo sag no no, I wanted to see the pack Is it much supposed camo. to look and sound the same? Unless it's the glitch. It's copied and pasted. Craft here. Let's uh, go give court effects. I, I think it. I think it's. I think it's kind of different from Cold War. But again, we'll talk about all my thoughts at the very end, because I want. I want to do a full experience. There isn't one. Oh. Intruders. Kind of sad. I will crush you with sheer numbers. <laughs> like, like. What? Yeah, okay. Well, that, well, well, don't need to wait till the end for that. That's bad. <laughs> not having a pack a bunch camo is not great. <laughs> well, 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 we'll sugarcoat that. Not having a pack a bunch camo is not is kind of bad. Like that's that. Look at me again, asshole. Wait. Oh, wait. You can't. Wait. Half pack a bunch of sounds, at least. Wait. Why, why, why does it have a? Why does it not have a pack a bunch sound when I'm uh? Wait. Does it have a pack a bunch sound or not? Wait, it does and then it doesn't. I'm confused. Best part about the headshot? Just the oh, that, I got a turn. Okay. So we got a we got a friendly zombie. Rain and rock kills. I mean elimination. So you do get killed uh, points for that. Right, we got one minute left. Five or fifty. I will kill you all. Do you automatically pick up ammo or no? It doesn't. Headshot. The most satisfying. Yeah, ring of ring fire, world. not like. Oh, hello. Max armor. Oh, so that's like the new carpenter. That's so that's the new drop that'll refill armor. What? My God, shut up already. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. Shut up, you demented fuck! 
Why is she so angry, dude? Why can't I pick up this ammo? must rest. Do I have two? Oh, do ARs share ammo with other ARs? Is that a thing? Pleased with your performance. Improve on it next time. Salvage. 550 on that. Um, one list will not forgive this. No, no wonder weapons? Then again, to help him. <sighs> um. You've hardly broken a sweat. But if you must withdraw, there is a way. Oh, uh, so, there, so there's exfil. Once you're caught in that fight, Um, oh, here we go. Now I can get speed cola. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Bullet meet face. Face meet door. All right. So we, we have boost reload speed, Oof. demonic frenzy. Which is definitely going to be a big boy. Um, I need to switch out my other gun here. Let's, let's, let's get this to level. Ready to vomit. Let us just say 5k it is a drink for warriors. Okay, so that that's pretty significant. I, I did level it up to level three. But that's that's a pretty pretty significant boost in reload speed. Um Rise, revenants, destroy. Yeah, not sad about that. What is that? Max armor again? So let's see. If I switch this out, it's a shotgun. Maybe you look better now. Um, well, there was a crystal there. Did I already? Did I already do it? So it looks like there's there's always just stuff to kill. Ow, those things hurt, man. Okay, it's kind of concerning me. Oh, there we go. I got the ammo that time. Maybe the, I just had too much ammo or something because I had two ARs. I'm not sure. Um, okay, so we have another harvest goal. This is actually our last goal that's on the map right now. All right, there we go. Oh, and then uh, that, that perk is in there. Okay, so this is another rune rune stone collecting. <clears throat> um, all right, let's let's check it out. Yeah, again, uh, again, chat. We're 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 waiting till the very end, and then we're I'm giving thoughts and everything like that. There's the obelisk. Okay, so th so basically, this is the same objective that we did before, but now we're on Shino Newman's deck. as many as it takes to have my vengeance. Dude, the exploding ones are actually really, really, really... Uh, like, dangerous. Like, they hit from pretty far away. They, they do... They do, like, a decent amount of armor damage, you know what I mean? Dude, dude, I mean, dude, they, they clap. Okay, I will find it, plaything. I am plaything, and plaything is I. Yeah, I mean, I mean, not giving, not giving a presence yet, but just like what it is. Back. What just started shooting at me? My god, my health is gone. Oh my god, what? The explosion I can handle, but it's screaming. Oh, and you have to aim your ring of fire, it doesn't just spawn. Why is 
thing so strong? So it, he drops an armor drop. Look at me again, asshole. Oh, you can't. Okay, harvesting complete. Bro, that guy, that that dude was like unfairly powerful. Um, yeah, that guy, that guy clapped. Curl up and sleep right now. So satisfied. Drop some thermite instead, I guess. Why not? We can try out the thermite. Bro, that guy, that guy, I was standing in Ring of Fire and he did not care. He just, he just owned. Um. Craft to special forces. We have it changed. Go on to your bed. What happens now? Does it just give me some new objectives to unlock more and more areas? Best mark? About the headshots, it shuts them up. So that's what it seems like it's gonna do. So we definitely wanna go get armor level two. For sure. That is a Hundo P. Just kidding, we can't if we need 50 more. 50 more salvage. Can I just chill for a second? Can we all just calm down for a few moments here? Okay, I'm not getting any like any ammo drops. Ammo, please. Hey, my name is Noah. Can I have some ammo, please? God, this gun, this gun is, this gun is terrible. Wait, can I, can I grab the same? Uh, okay, there we go. Let's get, let's get some, let's get, oh, mildew camo. Mmm, yes, 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 mildew camo. What I've, what I've been waiting for. <laughs> the next best thing to victory made. Okay, so we have new armor. This is how we exfil right here if we want to leave. Um, let's see, what, what do we want to buy here, chat? Hmm. It's not pre-recorded, you you dummies. <laughs> Chance to turn an enemy. Oh, melee attacks do. Oh, I, so let's get purple this brain rot. assist me in my path. I, I don't really want to be meleeing. Hmm. <clears throat> Pack a bunch is 15k. Hit the box, maybe? Yeah, maybe hitting the box would be good. Let's, let's, hit, let's hit the box the once. Pack a punch, Bryn. So I guess blue is like. Yeah, blue is already pack a punched. Yeah, you can see it in the little thing at the bottom right. It shows how much. Bro, I was just trying to buy some perks. Oh wow. Okay, so he he actually does get turned as well. Face. Face Interesting. Bullet. Interesting. Uh 720. Alright. Let's I guess go to this one. I don't know where I'm gonna be Strike going next. All I actually don't know. Available during teleport, unavailable. So basically you get locked out of everything when you start teleporting. Interesting. Uh, is there dark ether? I think there is dark ether. Yeah. All right. Each revenant Blitz. carries oh, a this bit is the campaign of mission. magic. Kills them, and you weaken the demon. Bro, you, you... Interesting. Now There's killing to be done. You know what I would love? You, you, you know what actually I would love for round base? Oh, 
I want I want the I want the Easter eggs to literally be as hard as Revelations to solve every single one of them. But I want like a week a week straight of playing the map before the Easter egg is unlocked. Thoughts, chat? Everyone is incredibly hard, but we have a week straight of playing the map before uh, before before it, it like launches. Thoughts? I actually really like the idea, but I, I, I might be wild now, brother. Wait, there's no nuke animation. Why was there no nuke animation? Why was there no nuke animation? <laughs> I, yeah, yeah, no, no, I know. I'm, I'm just saying the map, round based maps in general, because this game. Oh, God, not again. Why did, why does it do that? Yes, yes, I am you are very important. Well, I unlocked an operator or something. Wait, what was this viable thing? My am oh ammo. This will suffice. Okay, I like this gun much better. Gun is very fun to use. This gun is very, very fun to use. I like this a lot. Zed's land. Oh, that, that's, that's the one that I had. Pleased with your performance. Improve on it next time. Okay, thank you, Dad. Thank you, Demon Dad. <laughs> Splendid work, my allies. Apparently, the energy, energy mine is the best field upgrade. I would believe it. Free. I would definitely believe it. Can you switch mid game? Because as of right now, Ring of Fire just seems like it's kind of glitched. Like it doesn't spawn Time underneath my feet. This court like what out. Of your demon's oh, I, nice. I can't switch. I'll leave us to an obelisk. You'll know what to do. Deal much more damage when shooting while stationary. Uh, I don't. I, when am I ever going to be like standing still? What? Professor, it is time to get your toy. Satisfying feeling in the world. This is why I definitely I need, I definitely need to pack a bunch again, that's for sure. My, my guns are not are not Sturmkrieger? My god, these Nazis are full of themselves! <laughs> what what is that what does that even mean? Oh my god, there's so many zombies here. Goodness gracious. All right, so I didn't really like any of those. Uh, I kind of need to re-up my armor a little bit. How much does it cost to re-up your armor? 250, no, F it. Yeah. All right, uh, and then I think there was a Professor, perk over here. It is time to bid your toy soldiers auf Wiedersehen. Yeah, yeah, I needed this over here. So there's five perks total. Increase crit damage. Okay, thirst quencher, yeah, yeah. yeah. Look at me again, asshole. So there's a there's a lot of like 
I don't know. There's a lot of like customization in the route you can take on like how you want to upgrade yourself first. Um, let's see. Oh, uh, let's upgrade this. You are fools to do crap. But once you are dead, you will answer my command. Yo, Bunless, that's crazy. I don't remember asking, bro. It shuts them up. Ooh, okay. I remember when a stone was ammo. Humans have come along. Dude, the, the, the Sturm boys are, uh... I took out tanks in Stalingrad. You are not for me. This is armor level one. So we already, we already have full armor. Uh, at least I, I'm kind of sad that I paid for armor because all of that, all of these guys have so much armor on them. Well, we're kind of, we're kind of just farming some stuff here. Um, okay. Let's see what do we got here. Oh, monkey bomb. Let's go. Okay, so monkey bomb makes a return. I actually didn't know that that was making a return or not. First I've seen it. Owen gun. This is no a good for pack level bear. two. But for these shit hats? This is a weird weapon. Holy crap. All right. Um. So anything else we want to buy here? Eh, I'm trying to think. We got... Eh, I think we're. I think we're good. Right, let's go. Feeling sluggish. Cortex's magic steals your demon's power. <clears throat> rune stones, here we come. Oh, the rune the rune stone one is definitely the hardest. <clears throat> the rune stone the rune stone one is definitely the Souls, hardest. You are in my crosshairs now. Only round seven? Uh, yeah, it's, will it's like you. outbreak. It really is like outbreak. It like it, it like ramps so up quickly. They are taking power that belongs to me. And even this even this level two pack a bunch. Shot, one less it seems like you kinda have to get headshots. Like let, let me let me show you let, like let's let's do a little experiment here. Headshot kills that fast. Oh my god. Bruh. I always get my revenge. You have to be facing it as well. You can't turn around and shoot while you're okay. depositing. Get him, friendly exploding boy. Boom! That's kind of cool. I like that. I like that. That's kind of cool. Nope. Never mind. Yeah, these, these things are not dropping very often. So, I mean, that's that's kind of a strat. That's kind of a strat. You just, like, hard commit to depositing the Sin Eater stuff. And uh, it'll, it'll, like, kill all the zombies around you after it's done. Sorry, Are you using those? All right, let me, let me see what this, this does. Okay, it's pretty neat. Stun mine. I can use this. Did you get the attention you wanted? Better be careful, not to use that.
Bro, your own hey, explosives do an insane amount of damage to yourself. They do it. It does an insane amount of damage to yourself. Um. Send a distress call. Send a distress call? So you can send our cry for help. Bro, you, you guys you guys talk a lot of mess to be calling for help, I gotta say. Alright, so we need 3k. Scrap, you guesser. Can create marvels. Give it a try. Give it a try. Um I'm kinda I, I'm kinda happy with my guns right now. Should we go for a pack a bunch level three? Or should we buy some more perks and stuff? I might buy the a little bit more crit damage, because I think crit damage is kinda useful. Especially against the boss and stuff. Bro, them spawning right in front of you is, is not easy to deal with. I wish it told you, like, by how much you were actually... It tastes cabbage. Hello? Hello? Um, I, I want to see, like, how much I'm actually getting more powerful. I don't like it when I just, like, it's just an arbitrary, like, oh, you're getting more powerful. Like, cool. Tell me how much, you know? I wish it told me, like, percentages like this stuff. It's the slow enemy while shooting thing, at it. But I yes. will use it all the same. A bullet for your thoughts, comrade. You hit like a Nazi. Ow, jeez. Okay. That wasn't bad at all. Wait, there's a crystal here somewhere. Wait, I came over here to shoot a crystal. There's not a crystal here. Sag. Um, okay. You ate those hits? Oh yeah, we were we were tanking those hits. Boost region speed. By this. You're drinking with a Petrova now. You are fools to do crap, pity. But once you are dead, you will answer my command. Bro, uh, why, why, like, why have I heard the same quote like well, seven times now? <laughs> yeah, so that requires more points. Right, I'm pretty happy with my perks right now. My level of perks. I think next Attention. up is. We need to dispatch a message to the dark. I think next thing up is getting pack much level three. Many there still hold a grudge. I think that's I think that's the idea. Is there an enemy's health bar? Yes, there is. No meat, no main Easter egg. There's no main Easter egg at launch. It'll be coming after season one, so like at least a month out. I think it. Uh, when is it like it's probably coming season 1.5 which i don't know how long that is energy mine might be like a get out of jail free card okay don't let me buy any more armor I'm a fan of that. I, I, I thought two forms of salvage was kind of kind of unnecessary. Well, Shino Numa looks cool, at least. Gotta, gotta get that nostalgia in. I mean, it works. Like, Shino Numa looks cool. It's fun to, it's fun to do objectives here. 
I just hope the saying is true. <clears throat> mm -mm. Um, yeah, we're we're gonna have we're gonna have a discussion about everything after. Craft. All right, Pog. Let's hear through. Go give Colton the I'm like missing headshots hardcore right now. Look at me again, asshole. You can't. Got him. Uh, how much was armor tier three? I think it was like 3k salvage. All right, so let's keep saving up our money. And I guess let's. Oh, well, let me check. I all. The big thing to remember is always checking here. Critical kills return two bullets to the clip. Ooh. Let's do that. Let's the done. Let's get back to killing. Stowed weapons refill ammo from stock quickly. That's kind of nice. That's kind of nice. I, I like that. I let's try. Let's try those. Let's battle. try those too. I actually, I actually think I like if yes, you just be able to switch I'm between guns totally and skipping not. the reload is kind of nice actually. Strike down. All and then I don't need to buy any more speed cola levels. How many levels do the perks have? I know they mentioned it, but I don't. I don't remember. Are there any wonder weapons? According to my chat, no. According to my chat, there are not. It's only four? You know what to do. I thought it was more than that for some reason. This refill ammo from the I really really like this refill ammo from the magazine thing. Armor level one. Was that your face or your ass? Oh, I really, really like this. Like that that I'm gonna need to hit a reload on that, but. Right now I have like a run and gun build almost where like everything everything is all about me not having to reload, which is actually working out really, really nicely. Like I just have a ton of ammo, like my bullets are getting restocked one on crit shot, kills. One less revenant. Reloading is like a zombie player's worst nightmare, eventually. right? I'm literally skipping it. I'm literally skipping out on reloading. Like I'm just, I'm literally just switching, switching weapons. A throwing knife was absolutely useless right there. Maybe you look better now. Nope. Never mind. Was that a... Keep coming, you undead Nazi dogs. Uh, try it again. See what happens. It's not useful if I can't like place it in a good spot and have it explode. That just that just didn't seem as useful as you I thought it was gonna be. Blood enemy of Wolfram von List. Um Frost Blast, maybe? Oh, we have Ether Shroud now. Let's try Ether Shroud out. Perhaps you will end on this. 
Perhaps. Oh, you can this. break the doors. That's kind of cool. <laughs> um. Okay. So what round are we at now? What are we, what are we up to? That grand contagion smell all around us. It weakens too deep. Let's find a place to make a point. Uh, turn in the middle. Keep equipment. No, I don't. I don't want any of that. I don't want it. I don't want it. Ooh, I almost have enough for Pac Man Tier Three. You don't deserve my mercy. Kind of poggers. Um, should we just go straight into it? Yeah, I'll F it. Let's just go straight into it. Sarexis. Shows Honestly, the HUD, the I don't hate the HUD, to be completely honest. I think the HUD's kind of clean. Like, what are y'all's thoughts? I, I actually, I feel like it gives all the info. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't hate the, I don't hate the HUD. All right, harvest, so we need to, oh God, this harvest one's the hardest one. Bro, the, the difference between hitting and not hitting uh, headshots is immense. Did you really think you could like, stop actually me? immense difference in damage. How many must die like, unbelievably you different. That was kind of scary. Yeah, I, I honestly think this is the hardest one. Extra ones on the ground. It's not even close in my mind. Like not even like not even close. That's the hardest one. Shall we go raise some hell? All right, let's go. At least the monkeys are in. Yeah, I, I mean, Keep I mean, hopefully the monkeys would be in there. The hopefully. In this together. <clears throat> All right, we're chilling. We're chilling. We need help. Alright, let us get Pack Munch Tier 3. Once we go through a portal. Yeah, it quite literally does 10 times the damage to get headshots. Okay, let's see the Altar of Covenants here. Enemies killed by explosions. Oh, sorry, yeah, I, I, eh. Load weapons, refill ammo from the stock more quickly. Let's switch this out for slow, I think. Yeah. In for a penny. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and get maxed out jug here. We want maxed out jug. Trespassers uh. will not be tolerated. Scared me, quarterback. Chill, bro. So we have like we have like a, a maximum tier jug now, right? I think we can't buy any more. Okay. 
We have max jug. Oh, we can now buy max armor too. Your mechanical skills are impressive. So, so basically, basically, it seems like it takes about till like round 10, 11 to get like a maxed out gun, maxed out armor, and like one maxed out perk. Um. All right, let's continue on. I guess. Professor, is this? it is time to bid your toy soldiers I'll be the same. I'll be this in. Help us send a message to the dark. Yeah, yeah, so there's there's no pack much camo. There is dark ether though that you can earn and it's green apparently, right? Is that what people are saying? I have learned a little rune magic. I even helped to make that all. That is ugly aft, dude. So that is sure. ugly aft, bro. This is a brilliant idea. Was that your face or your ass? Hard to tell. Oh, where are we going? Oh, I've never gone in here before. Get the fuck away from me! <laughs> <laughs> the close, close man. See what happens! Fucking hurt! Alright. We do have max, shot, max to your jug, weapon. though. So that's good. <laughs> max to your jug, definitely. Anything to shut you up! Definitely helping out the old survivability. It seems like this is definitely like outbreak, outbreak type scaling where round 10 is actually like round much higher than round 10, you know what I mean? I never turned down something. Maybe it was better now. Nope, never mind. Ammo, thank you. All right, we're chilling. Bullet, meet face. Face, and there it is. Meet bullet. Easy clap. Turning to Stalingrad. Kill you long before help comes. Who is this help that we're sending for? Everyone seems to know who this help is, except for me. This time help will come. You know it. Again. Who? Who what what are you talking about? Let us hope whoever. Like actually have no clue. Worse than court effects. <clears throat> Mm, all right, Let's see here. Kill the enemy. Invicta will open the way. Enemies killed by explosions. Yeah, I, I mean, it looks like we've seen. Find the right place for me to open a portal. It seems, it seems like we've seen all of the. Uh, about the headshot. Shut them up. The upgrades and everything like that. Shut all right. That's what I'm saying. Dude, you gotta land headshots. Holy. I can't believe how headshot reliant this game is. Type 11. Sorry, this? but it did not seem like you were using that face. Eh. Small package, heavy firepower. Just like me. More than that LMG. All right, let's go ahead and fully max out our headshot crit damage. Oh, 
Okay, so we are now maxed on tier four. Professor, it is time to bid your toy soldiers so poggers. Um, okay. What else do we need to do? Uh, let's let's max uh, speed cola. Mortal fools, you came a long way just to die. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We get it. God. Bullets meet face. Face. Goodbye. I'm just. Uh, hey, no, hey, come on now. No, re no reason to fight that man. All right. So we have. You will answer my commands. We have three max perks now. Three max round 12 for three max perks, a max gun, maxed armor, one uh, one gold and two purple uh, art covenants. What are what are they called? I wonder what demon that blood belonged to. Oh, is that is that is that what it's supposed to be? Each demon is a different blood. Whatever comes at you, send it back to hell. Mm -hmm. What what are your what are your thoughts? I will be talking about my thoughts at the end. Destroy the intruders. My plans will not be thwarted. I want to I want to do a full game first. Headshots. The most satisfying feeling in the world. The most satisfying. It looks like all the drops stay pretty much the whole time though. Which is, which is good. Max armor. Oh he actually says max armor as well. Thank you, Bellicar. Thank you, thank you, Bellatrix the Brave. Or what? What is Bellatrix's like little, little name in Harry Potter? The part about the headshots? It shuts them up. Easter egg live are coming soon, and not for at least a month and a half. I think. inside the dark ether story think you found something only my undying hatred oh no not the undying hatred oh no 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 satisfactory perhaps can you slide cancel i'm playing on uh, ps4 right now and i uh i don't know how to slide can or ps5 rather i don't know how to slide cancel i, I usually play on pc so toy soldiers i'll be the same my friends Cold effects can weaken, he can be beaten. Well done. Now what? Holy 
Holy crap, just die. Okay, why did he get so much stronger? I literally was melting these guys like three seconds ago, and now they're like a beast. Um, okay. Was there anything I wanted here? You know, much more damage than shooting. Well, stationary. Um, eh, why not, right? We'll try it. We'll try it. I learned this from the Maya. I learned this from the Maya. Who the F is the Maya? <laughs> <laughs> Who is the Maya? What does that mean? Ugh, right, region speed tier two, tier three. Not region satisfied. speed tier four. And now I just have one more perk to max out. Pretended liquor. Very bad liquor. Um got a pistol here. Wait, does the pistol explode? I wanna I'm kinda Come. curious. Together we will put these undead assholes to rest. Why do I feel like this would actually be good? Hold on. Why, why do I feel like this pistol is actually feel my actually gonna slap? Let me see. Professor, it is time I lied. Can confirm. You don't Does indeed. Not slap. No. No, you have my okay, so I'm going from. Jeez, man. And everybody. I always get my revenge. Professor, it is time to meet your toy. Bro, can y'all just shit? The armor, thank you. Maybe you look better now. No, never mind. Gun damage is definitely slapping now. I'll tell you, I'll tell you that much is a hundred percent certain. Sir Exis, it's time to feed. Hundred percent slapping. This pistol kind of mid, that's fine. Prepare to kill and yeah, pis pistol, pistol duty. Sad. Glad, so glad those zombies have stormtrooper aim bro the very first one that spawned had the opposite dude he had like literally just actually aimbot see the senator arbalist get some room stones in that thing quick as you can okay the zombies are moving now too you see this my enemies Why, when did this get so hard? I am not the forgiving type. Bruh. Bro, this got so much harder on round 13. Look at me again, asshole. Oh, wait. You can't. I finished it. You hit like a Nazi. Admit it. You deserve that. I will kill you for touching me. Bro. Oh my god, why is it so much harder? This part about the headshot? I'll shut them up. Jeez, man. It's, it's actually hard. Yeah, this is a this is a maxed out damage build right now. Like this is a maxed out gun and maxed out uh I will kill you all. Dude, it's just it's just all about headshots, man. Regret that, pig. Headshot. The most satisfying feeling in the world. It just, it really is all about headshots. This is a completely maxed 
down damage build. Like, literally everything on my build has to do with having the highest you damage possible. You could stop me. That's only around 13. Teach me. Teach me, a wise master. Partners strong. They are certainly <sighs> Any wonder weapons? Apparently there are no wonder weapons now. There are no wonder weapons to be mentioned. Attention. We need to dispatch a message to the dark ether. Okay. Once we go through a portal, I'll explain in greater detail. Oh, is something actually is something actually happening? Bullet meet face. Face meet Pause. bullet. Pause. Pause champ chat. Is, is something about to happen here? You are fools. You will answer my command. Oh my god. Ow. I will kill you for touching me. Jeez, man, it gets. Sorry, but it did not seem like it I, I'd say right like place. round 14. What? Equ Can't equivalent what to round dish. base. Round 14 is like. All right, there we go. We have fully maxed up every single perk. So we're, we are now literally. Oh my God, you do move fast though. You're, we are literally as fat, as as, as beefed thing. up as we can be right now, essentially. Like, except for maybe, like, a little bit more uh, gold covenants. But this is basically as beefed up as we can be. Um, craft armor. Let's repair this. That will serve you well in Dude, the zombies just hit so hard. Maybe it looks better now. We're fully beefed, nope. and they're still Never just mind. absolutely clapping. Dr. Monty. <laughs> All right, let's Bella see here we go. And I are recruiting new allies from the Dark Ether. Since we can't contact more armies, we must seek what help we can get. All right, so is this is this gonna be like a special round or something? It seemed it seemed like it, she was like go through the portal and I'll explain more. Um. The orb carries a message for the Dark Ether. Stay close. You don't deserve uh, my mercy. Mod, mod check? Mod check? Where's the, where's the uh, special thing we were going to be doing? Bro, this is this this is difficult right now, man. Be warned. I always get my revenge. One shot, one less revenant.
chance again, Pig. Can't afford ammo. Two sides of the same person. Am I supposed to just train? And I'm dead. You hit like a Nazi. Crab, are you watching? Your champions are mine. And that's it, I guess. Your battle pass, so that's kind of cool. Um, okay. Okay. Uh, so we get... So are these zombies things or are these just things in general? If you need help here? with camps again this year, you already know I'm down. BTW, I'm on mobile, so I'm pretty much useless as M. Uh, with, wait, with camps again? What does that mean, with camps again? Okay, so I level up to level 10. That's some pretty decent, like, actual XP, I guess, so that's good. Um, yeah, we're about, we're about to talk about all my thoughts on the game and everything like that. Just, I, I, I'm just, I, I, I'm, I'm interested in what happens in the post-match screen and everything like that. What all the way unlocked and everything. So, seems like decent, decent gun levels. Camo. Let's look at, let's look at the camos as well to see like, you know, if it's, if it's exactly like the, uh, uh, what's it called? Okay, uh, whatever. Uh, okay, so weapons. So we get, so we get custom loadouts. Is there anything special we can customize? Okay, so it's literally just those four, and then you pick your gun. Okay. Um, we unlocked a new operator here. Haliba Zambadi grew up with. Uh, okay, so we have a new operator. We got a new or a new MVP highlight for this. Because I got, I guess I got this. Oh, I guess so. You can level up your operators as well, which is. That's kind of cool. I like that. Uh, barracks, customization, calling cards. We got, we got a new calling card, calling card frames. Uh, okay, let's go to loadout, gunsmith, customize, camouflage. So zombies. So this is the new dark ether right here. That is gold. Plague Diamond, Dark Ether. It's green this time. And then it looks like it's the exact same as before where you, where you have to level up the gun in order to uh, open up the challenge slots and everything. Uh, look, let me, let me actually switch. Where's that SMG that I used a bunch? Is it the Type 100? Wait, did I not get weapon levels for that gun? No, I did. I did get weapon levels for that gun. What what gun was I using there? Um, operators. Oh, got another operator just by leveling up. Takio? Um, okay. Well, I guess it's time for thoughts. Um, unlock something there. Unlock something else. Okay. Uh, type 100 was the gun I was using. Let me look. SMGs type 100. Weapon level. Oh, so you can you can level up the actual like because if you look behind my face cam, it's weapon level 11, but I can't actually select it yet because I haven't unlocked it, which is good. I, I'm glad you can level up guns before they're, they're actually unlocked because then it just feels like you're wasting time. I really like that. Um. Okay. I guess let's talk thoughts. Um, so how long did that last? That lasted like an hour and 30 minutes? Or hour and 20 minutes, hour and 30 minutes? Um. Camos. Oh gosh. I meant camos. Autocorrect oh, gets camos. you every time. Got you. Got you.
Gotcha. Oh, like like to spawn more zombies like we did in that stream. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Um Okay. Thoughts. Thoughts, thoughts, thoughts. Um I was not a huge fan of Outbreak. I was not a huge fan of Outbreak. I I prefer round based and I prefer hard Easter eggs. I prefer like that being the content of the map is like solving the Easter egg. And then once the Easter egg is solved, everyone speed runs it. I like that formula and Cold War did good speed runs, but the Easter eggs were really easy. And that's, you know, that's okay. That's, that's how they wanted to do it. They wanted to keep it for casual players. This, an outbreak I would say is more of a casual player experience where it's like someone who's not really paying attention and doesn't really need to be paying attention can just play play through um i think i think the most obvious thing is that treyarch was for like not forced but you know asked to make a, a game mode for this game so that they could say oh call of duty vanguard has zombies in it and from their interviews and stuff like that it looks like they're only basically going to be adding in like you know the same kind of stuff that they would add to outbreak like new regions new like it doesn't seem like they've hinted at all at that they're going to be doing a round based at all um so that that like this is it it's just going to be expanded upon that may or may not be true we can't really look to the future but as it stands right now i think some people will enjoy this a lot uh, if you liked Outbreak, you're going to love this. It has out Outbreak elements, but just more, like, progression and, like, class building and just, like, shaping your character. If you liked Outbreak, you're probably going to like this. Um, for me, I don't like it. Maybe Season 1, I, it will be a like, bit better. I, I don't... Maybe. Maybe, Marshall. I mean, all, all I can say is that right there... I feel like I just played a really, really dope custom zombies map that maybe I'll play again a couple times, but there's no replayability for me. Like, I didn't like Outbreak. I prefer round based. And that's not to say round based is the most replayable thing in the entire world either for me, but I much prefer it. And I much prefer the Easter egg hunts, the fact that it obviously just didn't have enough time and that's not the developer's fault i don't think any of this is the developer's fault i think it's just the that's just how it goes um like i'm not i'm not blaming the developers at all because i understand that they work really 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 like developers work unbelievably hard uh and it's not their fault but i just think that the the idea to do it like as outbreak style was a mistake i know that they look at the i know that outbreak had a huge player count boost for black ops cold war so they basically want to keep doing that and maybe the numbers do show that everyone in this stream is probably a hardcore zombies fan right like would you guys say that you're a hardcore zombies fan if you if you're in this stream right now like say say like on a scale from one to ten how big of a zombies fan are you like how long have you like if you've been playing i wish a long we time, could go like back that. to the d days Satch. the de days yeah um like I'd say I'd say everyone in here is a zombies hardcore fan like and, and the fact that you like watch streams you like know the easter eggs you can name all the maps like you you like have done easter eggs yourself like you've been doing it for a long time I think that this for hardcore zombie fans is not 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 good not it's not a good hardcore zombies fan experience that being said, if they have data on the back end that shows that more people play this these kind of game modes and more people play Outbreak than the round based maps, you know, it is what it is. Like we're 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 part of the minority and that's just how it's going to be. Um but I think I think that I would have preferred Treyarch do nothing on Zombies this year and come next year with a stacked plate like BO4 had. Like BO4 like love it or hate it in terms of its mechanics and game design it had a hardcore you fan insane smile. amount of content oh thank you josh i'm a, I'm a hardcore you fan too bo4 had an insane amount of content offering like i didn't it wasn't my favorite like in terms of like the such map a shame designs and it the, was so hyped know, up ha ha 
Thanks for the 50, Marshall. Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I, I try not to be negative on my channel. Um, but, you know, I'm just, I, I also just, whenever, whenever I definitely feel something, I just want to, you know, be able to say it and not be scared. Um, Anti Boy, uh, thanks for the tier one membership. Um, yeah, like literally the devs did as much as they could in the time that they had. And I, I think, I think the, the story is cool. I think the demons are cool. Um, I think the zombies design are cool. I think visually it looks really cool. It's just the gameplay. Like I, I, I almost just wish they just said like, F it, we're going back to our roots and we're gonna like, just go back to BO3 style gameplay. We're gonna go back to BO3 zombies and we're just gonna make more maps for BO3. Like we're gonna just have that be the system. Like, and just let people like, cause it's just obviously zombies most popular time to this day. Like I stuff that I upload on BO3 will get more views than like Black Ops Cold War to this day. Um, this or World War II zombies, honestly, if this like as it stands right now, I think World War II zombies is like because you can speed run World War II zombies. You can do like side Easter eggs, like the map. It's a round based map. Um, I I honestly prefer World War II zombies to this. And, and you know and that's and that's okay like I, not everyone has to like every single thing um it's and, and and also the difficulty just ramped up like crazy but i'm not like mad about dying it's like i you know got it that, that's the kind of thing you have to adapt to and realize that round 14 is the new round like 50. um it's it's i don't know it's like i i i had a lot of stuff i wanted to do when black ops cold war came out like it, it wasn't like it wasn't like bo3 for me like i like i had that kind of drive for it but i still really really enjoyed uh like a lot of black ops cold wars offerings and the amount of content they put out but this is just like it's just not the style of game that game mode that i like playing like i i don't i'm not an outbreak fan i much prefer round base myself so I don't know. I I I almost wish they would stop just shoehorning zombies into everything and actually give this team like time to make Man, an entirely. Man, we took for granted the both three hunts experience. and streams that would last for days. Sag. Yeah, those were those were the those were very 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 good times. And and then and then it's also kind of frustrating because like Black Ops Cold War spent an entire season like building up the arsenal and there's so much cool stuff. And Black Ops Cold War by the end of it, like all the different skills, all the different perks, all the different uh, like um, field upgrades and like everything like the Cold War, like by the end of it had a ton of stuff flushed out in it. And now you get on this game and there are four and they're all re like reskins of something that we already had. We literally already had all of these and now we only have four of them. We like basically a bunch of stuff has been taken away and now we're like starting over. And then I guess maybe the content is just going to be adding the stuff back again. And I don't know, that's, I, that doesn't, I mean, it, it's all like, it's all development based. I'm sure if they like, I'm sure they would have loved to launch with like everything that they had in black ops cold war, but it's a different engine. It's a different, you know, it's a different system and off topic, but can't uh, wait to see your next know, multiplayer pop off. Hopefully something soon inspires. Thank you, thank you. I mean, yeah, it's just it's just tough because I really want to like it. I really want, I truly do want the mode to be good. I truly care about the mode. Not only from like a, I'm a YouTuber and if the mode is doing well, if people are excited for the mode, my channel does well because that's the truth. Like if people are excited for this, if people are excited about Vanguard, then my channel does well. I earn more money and stuff like that. Obviously I have that like bias, but I also like just as a fan of the mode and someone who has, I don't know, been around for so long. I want, I want the mode to succeed and stuff like that. So yeah, I, uh, yeah. <laughs> who else thinks no should work for the developers for zombies? I've never been in game dev in my life. There are probably so many things that happen behind the scenes that we will literally never hear about or learn about that are answers to a lot of these questions i guess um 
So, I mean, I, I didn't get my expectations super high, especially, like, well, the trailer got my expectations high because the trailer was super sick. Um, but when I read about all the different gameplay elements and, like, how it works and everything, I I kind of just decided then and there that I was not going to keep my hopes high. And that's, you know, that's... That's not a that's not a fun way to go into a game, but it's to keep my expectations low. So I'm not I'm not necessarily super disappointed because uh, I didn't really have have super high expectations, especially based off what everyone who was like watching leaked gameplay had seen. But I wanted to give it a shot myself. Um, so I'll, I mean I'll still I'll still probably be playing it for the next few days. Um, but I mean to be honest with you, like what is there to what is there to do really like. Just go go to round 15 every day and then die and then, you know, call it quits, I guess. I don't know. There's no Easter egg. There's, I don't know. There, it, it's, it's just, like, it, it's very clearly not a game that's going to be very easy to make content on at all. Uh, which which kind of, you know, it kind of sucks. It's kinda, it kind of sucks. I'm not going to lie. It's it's not, not a fun, not a fun, not a fun feeling. Um, but... To be honest, like, even if the game wasn't, ex even if these games weren't exactly what, like, I would have designed them as, I, I, I think we really, we really did get spoiled with, like, Black Ops 4. Obviously, Black Ops 3 is, like, my gold standard. I literally love Black Ops 3 more than any game on planet Earth. Um, and then Cold War, honestly, like, I know people kind of cooked it for different, like, this and that reason, but Cold War was not bad at all. It, 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 it had it launched with a map it had round base they added content to it the whole the whole season i i think cold war all, like looking back on it had a lot of good stuff again it's not my favorite zombies experience and i'm not gonna pretend like it is but it had it had you know something it had something for everyone this this is just kind of like for outbreak fans and yeah and again i don't think it's the developer's fault i i think that like it's not a direction i would have chosen but even if it even if it was going in this direction which is not one i would have chosen i think with more time they could have fleshed out more things but that's just the cycle of them having to put out a call of duty literally every single year literally literally having to put out a a, a, a map like i actually think this has more personality like in the first couple minutes than cold war does because because the demons and the like kind of struggle with that uh i think that part's really really cool but I don't know, man. It's it's something that if you if you liked Outbreak, you're gonna like this. I personally didn't like Outbreak. I'm not a I'm not a huge not a huge fan because there's there's no I mean there's there's like no real objective in this. Like you can try to go for like a high round, but it's kind of it's not as much of an accomplishment feeling to get to like round 25 than it is to say like oh i made it to round 100 which both of those probably require the same amount of skill so high rounds is kind of meh there's nothing to speed run except for how fast can you get to a certain round which is ne never like a super fun speed run there's no easter egg obviously because they didn't have enough time so um yeah i I, I, I just I just hope that the next game that has zombies in it or or maybe they turn it around like maybe they you know end up doing a bunch of stuff that I really love on this one that'd be awesome too I just hope that the next game zombies isn't something that's kind of like forced in just to say that the game has zombies like let like and then obviously they need bigger budget like it's 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 so cool to see like the cutscenes and everything like that when they have budget behind them but then zombies budget gets pulled every single year just because we're you know we're the minority player race we don't spend as much on microtransactions and stuff like that so i guess now we just wait to see what blundell comes up with upside down face yeah i mean there's so many there's so many uh yes ice grade yes it's time for you to finish the map that you're making <laughs> um play the campaign play the campaign i actually might do a campaign stream tomorrow yeah it, it, it just right now it just feels like they took outbreak simplified it down a little bit to like smaller areas and not as much running around they took outbreak simplified it down removed a bunch of stuff that was already in the game and now that's what we have sitting here 
So, oh my God, has my hair been doing that crazy little thing right there the whole time? So, uh, I, that's that's how I feel. Let's let's talk though. What what are your what are your thoughts, chat? What are your what are your initial impressions? Zombies is dead forever. I don't think zombies is dead forever. I just think that they need to, you know, go in a direction that the community wants. Again, I guess. Like th like there was no moments during that where I was like, yo, like that's sick. Like even in like Mauder Toten and uh, Forsaken, like I had so many moments where I was just like, yo, like there's no wonder weapon. Like bro, how does how does a zombies Continue game launch with no wonder weapon? E's today. You know, and again, it's not the developer's fault. It's the people in charge who don't give more budget, give hire more people, allow more time, and just say, hey. We need a, I don't know. I, I it, It's just, it's just annoying that every single year zombies gets shafted. And I mean, not, not just zombies. Like they just release the game every, uh, release a new game every single year that the games always are just playing catch up. And when they finally catch back up and it's like, dang, this is like, okay, getting to be a pretty good game now. The next game is coming out. So the game's over. You know what I mean? There's no, there's no, Pack a punch camo. There's no wonder weapon. It, like I can see the idea and I can see the vision. There's just not. I don't know, man. There, I, like there's not a ray gun. Has anyone got a ray gun? I know that people have been streaming leaked gameplay. Like there, how is there not a ray gun in the game? You know. Like, what? How, how, like, there's no ray gun, no wonder weapon. I don't know, man. I feel so bad for the developers because I know, I know how much it sucks to work so hard on something and just have a bunch of people trash it. Like, I'm a content creator. I've worked really hard on videos before that have just been trashed for this reason or the other. That's like, you know. So, I, I, I know, I, I really feel for the developers because I know people are ruthless and like. Does the gunplay at least feel all good? This stuff. I was very excited for a zombies experience on the modern warfare engine. I, I think the weapon balancing is really off. Body shots do next to nothing. Maybe and now we can like get a firebow tutorial. Flushed face, flushed face. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> maybe, Mister Deadeye. Um, the gunplay, the gun, the guns feel good to shoot. They just. They just don't. I think I feel like the weapon balancing, like the body shots do next to nothing. The headshots do like a billion damage. So boycott. I mean, you need filler not content. You we don't need, need to do filler a boycott. Content. It's just like go play Kingdom Hearts from beginning. So much to play there. <laughs> Unfortunately, I do like getting views, so I'll probably not be playing Kingdom Hearts from the beginning. But <laughs> I, I don't think it's boycott. It's just like you know, if it's good, you buy it. If it's bad, you don't buy it. You know what I mean? It's not like we have to like band together. Like if if you think it looks good, buy it. Like don't don't boycott it for no reason. Like if you liked what you saw there, buy it. But you know, if if you don't like what you see, then you know if there's not like zombies is the only reason I really get Call of Duty every year. Like, and I love zombies so much. And you know the campaign. Well, that's not true. Like I'll play some multiplayer if it's a multiplayer I like. Like Modern Warfare, I had a ton of hours of multiplayer. I loved Modern Warfare's multiplayer. Um, and like I like playing through the campaigns. So I mean those are, those are two things that I like. Like, but to be honest, like 99% of my time always goes into zombies. So you think it better if zombies made their own separate franchise? I I don't know. Like honestly, if I could take zombies in any direction I wanted to, if I could take zombies in any direction I wanted to. I would take Black Ops 3 and hire on a bunch of these custom map makers and just literally constantly be having uh, like these little fun custom zombies maps coming out. I like, and then, but do it officially, like across everything. Like literally have like official support for mods on like Black Ops 3 
and just have it and, and just like have like rebrand Black Ops 3 Zombies to just like Call of Duty Zombies and then just literally hire on a bunch of these incredibly talented map makers. And every map doesn't have to be the most polished thing ever. Like Call of Duty, you know, everything's supposed to be polished. But if they just have like, you know, like verified map makers that, and then it launches on console and it just has constant updates. Everybody gets it. It's like each one gets its own little marketing push. You know what I mean? Like there's like a new map every week. Like, oh, what's this week's zombie map? Like, can you imagine how credible that would be with like every week there's a zombies map and I, and just like everyone understands that it's not the most like hardcore, like fleshed out, like incredible Easter egg, like everything like that. Um, like that that would be that would be where I would take zombies and I'm sure there's like a million and a half reasons why that you know there's a million and a half reasons why something like that doesn't actually work in a studio like with licensing and you know uh, different things that people use like like you know when it when you're at, when you're an actual company it's different than when you're actually you're like a small map maker but that being said I don't know So, I don't know. I don't know. I'm tired of gr grinding camos plus L game. Um, yeah, I I I have ab I got Dark Ether in Black Ops Cold War. I have absolutely no interest at all in getting Dark Ether here. No interest at all, in the slightest. I will not be doing it. Ugh. Yo, who is dropping a nuke on my forehead right now? What are we doing? What are we doing? Hi, Can I get some Noah nuke for in the Higher ice grenade for everyone's sake. Higher ice grenade indeed, dude. Hire this man. Make map making tools like Halo Forge, but in COD Zombies, that's the solution. That'd be incredible, dude. That'd be incredible. Rate it out of 10? Uh, it's hard to rate it. It's hard to rate it. Thank you so much, Marshall. Really appreciate you. Um, it's hard to rate it, but like, man, I, I, I'm not, I'm not going to give it a rating because I don't want to put an idea in people's minds about it when, you know, I want people to like look at the gameplay and form opinions for themselves. I don't want to, I don't want to put, you know, an idea into someone's head when they're still forming their opinion. Like that, I mean, I mean, right now I am putting those ideas in your head, but this is kind of like the critique part of it. Um, but I, I do think the visuals are really cool. I think the story is interesting. Um, I think that the dark ether entities are interesting. It just feels like it's building up to nothing. You know what I mean? Like, like, like when uh, sh the lady said, like, go through that portal. I'll like, and like we can take the next step. And then I went through the portal and it was just like, escort the head. That was it. Like there's nothing else. So it's like, every, there, everything is like a inkling. It, it's, it has like inklings of greatness and what it could be, but just what wasn't enough time. And then I just don't fully enjoy the, the way that the gameplay works. So. You enjoyed I, I, IW Zombies more when it came out. They at least trust me different. Yeah, I, I enjoyed I, I, IW Zombies when it first came out. Yeah, I enjoyed that. I even enjoyed World War II Zombies when it first came out. I think this is the first zombie game in a while that I'm just like, I could literally be ha like, I, I, I don't have a, I don't have a drive to, to get up and boot this up and stream it again today. I was planning on doing two streams today. I don't even know if I'm gonna do two streams today because like, I feel like I experienced everything in that mode in the very first time I played it. I I literally experienced everything. Give it an honest uh, stop stepping on eggshells. Uh, give us honest rating. We base real life purchases off your opinion. I mean, I'm telling you my entire opinion. I'm just not going to give you a number that because I mean I I'm telling you what I liked, what I didn't like, and quantifying that uh, with like my opinions and why I think the way that I do. So then you can listen to like, oh, I liked this. I liked 
I liked the lore because the lore was more about the dark ether rather than the soldiers involved in it. And I enjoy the, you know, ethereal stuff way more than I enjoy like a bunch of soldiers arguing. So that's a plus for me. But if you like the soldier part of it, then now you know that, you know, okay, well, if I, if I like the soldier part, I don't like that part. You know what I mean? And then like, say like with the gameplay, I, I'm saying I didn't like Outbreak. I do not like this. That lets you say, oh, I liked I Outbreak. I probably will like this. So, you know what I mean? Like, it, it's hard. It, I don't want to give a number. I want to give, like, my actual thoughts. And I'm not stepping on eggshells with those. Like, I literally got sent this copy of the game for free by Activision. And I'm still, and I'm still, like, you know. I'm, a I'm actively telling you guys that I'm not a huge fan of it. I'm, I'm, I'm giving you guys my honest feedback despite, you know, working with Call of Duty and doing a lot of stuff. Uh, and, and, and I mean, it is not all bad. Black it's not Ops all bad. It's just not, PLZ, I, I, I just think it's more for beginners and zombies rather than um, people who have played for a while. I think it's more for beginners rather than the hardcore audience. And you know, if their data shows them that's what, that's what they want to do. Um, Toss this uh, and, Vanguard and, you know, zombies. Bring back the Cold War pumpkins. Camo grind was so easy. I actually never played the, the Cold War pumpkin stuff. I actually never did it. Do a Black Ops 3 stream. Hey, we, hey, Tyler, we will sooner than you think, my friend. So, you know, I, 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 I don't know. I, I th that's my, that's my honest opinion. Um, and that's, that's kind of how I feel about it. So obviously form your own opinions. If you think it looks good, by all means, buy the game and everything like that. I'm just, those are my, those are my honest opinion. It, it just it just feels like zombies was kind of farmed for being able to say that zombies is in the game and getting zombies fans hyped up to buy the game it, fe it feels it feels kind of like shoehorned in and like developers didn't have enough time and you know we're forced to make a make a mode as quickly as possible in a brand new engine and everything like that so yeah and, and uh, yeah so Luckily, there's more zombie games coming out. I still want to do the last part of uh, Back for Blood. I still want to do the very last part of Back for Blood. Um, Dying Light 2 is coming out later this year. Um, basic ultimate guide for the map. Maybe a dedicated video about the Covenants. <laughs> Noah says he doesn't like the zombies at all. I mean, same. <laughs> oh my god. Yo, uh... Uh... Um... <laughs> I... I... <laughs> oh, man. It... I mean, it, like, it's hard. It's hard, man, because we are content creators. We want it. We want. We want it to be. We want it to be, like, we want it to be lit, dude. We want this game to be the best game I've, we've ever seen in our entire life. We want. We want it to literally surpass all expectations and literally be the greatest zombie game of all time. That is just the. It's the best, and that's our. That's like our objective. It's like making the game as fun as possible for fans of it, and that. Our content can like complement it and everything like that um you know so it's 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 tough it's not fun when you play it and you're just like man man it had potential sure but just not enough time to flush it out and not enough i don't know i didn't i didn't like the direction behind it <sighs> Y'all hate good map layout and gameplay. Y'all only like Easter eggs. I, I, I'm a. Hey, it sounds like you like this kind of zombies, and that's totally fine. I'm, I'm, I'm stoked that the people who liked Outbreak now get more Outbreak. Like they, they, y'all get more of what y'all want. Where it's like, like Easter egg aside, I don't care about the Easter egg. Let's play the game. You know what I mean? Let's just shoot some zombies and, and chill. 
and you can do that on a round base too, but you know. So. It's just, it, like, it just, I feel like, I, I think Zombies at its core is about the mystery and the discovery and then just learning new things and like learning new strategies and tricks. Cold War even had a lot of that. This, I feel like I have literally already experienced everything that I can, I can experience. Uh, tell, uh, tell Milo if he's, if he's down, I, I'm, a, I'm in Discord if he wants to talk. Extinction has more hype than newly dropped COD zombies. Well, I wouldn't go that far. I, Extinction's, Extinction DLCs were pretty... We're pretty down bad. Not gonna lie. <laughs> Battlefield is worth money. Boycott the game. Well, I mean, I mean, it's possible for multiple games to be good. Yo, I'm streaming. Just, just to warn you. Same. You I was back? just, I was just wondering if you wanted to discuss a little bit. I've just been discussing. I just finished my run. Uh, yeah. I just, I just finished mine a second ago as well. Um. I've been trying to be very careful with my words. Yeah. Um, but basically, there, there have been two times in history where I have felt like I actually can't recommend zombies to people. One was specifically the launch of BO4 when the game was just broken. Like, it just wasn't, like, stable, right? Mm -hmm. Um... And there's now. Best thing about and now Vanguard it's for a very different reason. Like there's bugs, but it's not blue screening every 30 minutes kind of thing. Um, yeah, thank you, Los. But I, I just, I feel like this no, is, is, it, is we've good. paid for zombies early access. I, so the, the way I described it is that I feel like they took Outbreak. They simplified it down, which is like, you know, not, not, not in like a simplified it down in that they like, made it worse it's just like i feel like we have been grounded this year in i guess zombies like and instead of like it being about exploration it's more so like get there do the objective leave yeah so that's not necessarily a bad thing in and of itself but it so if you don't like outbreak you're not gonna like this I, i'm not a huge fan of outbreak i'm not a huge fan of this simplify yeah. down out, outbreak and the cold war just spent an entire year adding all these really really cool things that honestly resulted in a pretty cool like customization yep. system and like just you know how people like just have so much choice and now we've been reduced down to without any skill tiers four reskinned things that we just had with now less function functionality and nothing new yeah and so it just feels like we we spent an entire year to get to the point where cold war was like you know, like maybe the mechanics aren't your favorite. Like maybe you prefer like, you know, a certain- Like the old point system yeah, or like yeah, something like yeah, that. Yeah, exactly. You, you prefer yeah. different stuff, but the game was like fleshed out. It had, you know, like five, essentially five maps and the game was like a, a full game. And now we've just reverted back to a simplified version of one mode with a, like four things instead of like 50 things. It's four things, but then also it's like, like part of what was ended up being really sneakily good in cold war is that like you jumped in and you had your first game experience and then you got out of that and you're like oh hell yeah i've got some ethereum crystals now i'm gonna upgrade a little bit and so your perks started getting even better and it was like you were getting more perks like we had 10 perks in that game at the end of uh, at the end of the game we started yeah. i think with five but with the first five perks like they ended up feeling like 15 perks because of all the upgrades that we could get at the very beginning when we had three upgrade tiers. So like that was a much deeper system that made you feel like you had something to work towards and that there was just, there was depth. Then on top of that, the, 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 the armor system and the salvage system that was new then, but um, like armor itself isn't that crazy. But the fact that it, uh, sorry, the fact that salvage 
meant that we could upgrade our weapons and it was like getting a feel for how upgrading the weapons affected things and the weapons actually felt viable the entire time you were playing and the AAT system was the best Stop I think it's trying ever to been in some regards because company. you could choose the one you wanted. We know it's not the devs they fault, it's the bad corporate like they had very specific play styles you could use them. them with. It wasn't just like one is objectively better than the other. Sure. So like that, that was really cool. There was a lot of depth there and th th there's just loads of things over and over like that. The... To say At first, in Cold War, I was I mean, a little bit like, ooh, I'm not sure we're, about this. We're basically but telling so everyone good. how bad it is, Dash. I don't know but if I'm trying to say face. this game doesn't have any of the complexity. Um, yeah. There, I, I don't like feeling... I think the, one of the best parts about zombies for me is the mystery. Uh, yeah. And, like, the yeah. unknown and the exploring. And, like, even if you, you know, you figure everything out, it still feels kind of like, oh, something weird could happen in this game. Like, you could get a quote you've never had before. And I literally feel like I experienced everything that 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 this game has to offer in, in a, a yep. 15 round run and yep, i feel here. like i heard every single quote already um, multiple times in the game yep like repeated multiple times and yep. I, again i i as i mentioned this before and i want to mention again i honestly don't think it's the developer's fault i think it's just kind of like what has been thrust upon them to make a game mode in a short amount of time that yep. is supposed to carry zombies so i i i, I don't i'm not like, if any developers are watching, just know that we're not saying this to, like, say, like, oh, this is your fault. I think it's just, like, the situation. I think Treyarch have done the best they could have done in the time they had, yeah. basically. Yeah. But I don't think that the time they had was a fitting amount of time yeah. to release a zombies mode and call it a zombies mode. Like, it's, it's a little bit... It's a little bit weird knowing as well that... Like we've all like in the uh, let's go back to Bo3 right we had like AATs in I would have been like, fine really, with really another cool. year of CW um, and I'm sad like, to hear this game mode really, isn't good for an addict from uh, COD and, stuff. and and in Cold War like you, you've got your AATs it's like I think they're all really cool in that game too um, you get to this as far as I can tell there yeah, are I, two I AATs Tyler. it's Cryo and Brain Rot yeah and what's gonna happen is in the season one update that they do on December 2nd, they're gonna release Deadwire. And it's gonna be like, yo, Deadwire is in the game now, but it's Deadwire? Like, yeah. we had that five years ago, you know what I mean? Like, maybe there will be a new one. And, and, and I welcome that. I, I welcome new things that they do. But when I just know for a fact the F it play around a with huge amount mode. of this game's post-launch uh, oh, content oh, 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 is going to be filling the gaps today. that already existed from today. the previous games. That is a that is a bad feeling for me. Yeah. Um. Because I mean, like, if there's if, no mystery. Yeah. If you look, if you look from, like, you know, look from Bo3 to Bo4, right? Like that is what I look at as like you know a meaningful change in zombies that doesn't result from taking away content because bo3 was vastly different in like its mechanics its gameplay like the way the maps flowed everything was different from bo3 to bo4 but no one can say bo4 was like lacking in content in any way like you can say I mean, oh i prefer so pre many maps <laughs> I, I, you can say you know i prefer bo3 to bo4 but you can't look at bo4 and say like they didn't put so much work into that game to get so many maps ready for launch and so much post-launch content as well um and i don't know it just it feels like the zombies right now is less about the like the actual gameplay and more so like oh what can we you know mid-season 2.5 this is what we're adding like type stuff yeah it, rather than i guess meaningful content or changes or I yeah. don't know. I, I honestly, no, I, I like, agree. looking back at Cold I'd War, they did a really good job. Boys yeah. and play this I, I literally, like, the, and how do I find the out day before yesterday, I is? basically just ran through and made a big list of is, but all the so stuff that I thought was really good in Cold Arts War, in like, in the end, and then the stuff that I think just didn't, like, miss the mark and stuff. And in hindsight, looking back over the whole year, I think Cold War did an incredibly good job in a lot of areas like they added to, the rampage inducer is so good that's such a good addition and it's so simple yeah um and there were so many things like that where it was little quality of life changes that just made made it more fun man yeah and i 
like you said, I feel like I have got, I have experienced the entirety of what this has to offer in one 15 round run. There doesn't feel like anything, th there doesn't feel like any reason to push further. Yeah. Yeah. It doesn't feel like there's any mystery remaining. I don't like, like, the, I also really dislike the dissonance that is created when the character, like, Belakar is saying, like, oh, you need to, like, get this head so I can send a message to the Dark Ether, right? Like, get it to the end of the thing. All right, I'm sending my message. And then she get you get to the end of the objective, and she's like, okay, time to make another orb. It's like, we're just going to do the same thing again because it's meaningless what we're doing. Like, it, it takes away... They're trying to give us purpose to what we're doing in the game, and then they literally tell us, yeah, it, it, was, it was pointless. It's like, come on, man. Yeah. I, like, it, have like, they do something. It, it, it had, it had like, I had a moment where I got really excited on like round 14 or something like that. Uh, yeah. The, one of the demons or whatever said, um, like, uh, like we, we need, we need to ca call for help, enter the next portal and I'll tell exactly. you more. And then I entered yeah. the portal and it was like, escort this head to the dark ether. Exactly. That's exactly what the, the, the quotes set it up to be like, Oh, this is gonna mean. This is gonna have meaning, and then you get to the end of it, and then the quotes are like, "Ha, nope." Yeah. Like, yeah. It's like what? Uh, yeah. I, I, I do think. I do think there are good parts, and I mentioned that I really like the demons more than you know Carver and the crew. Yeah. I, I think they're infinitely more interesting when you're actually dealing with Dark Ether, which is what makes zombies interesting, not the soldiers. Yeah. I yep. think the visuals are really, really cool. I think I love the way the zombies look. I love the designs. Um, I think Interesting. Like, visually everything is is really, really well done, but the gameplay is just not in a place that I mm. am. Like, I, I don't know. I, I, I'm it's just, not, I'm not just envisioning like of... this, like yeah. this style of map, but if they created like, like for instance, like imagine, you know how DE is like super, super blue. Yep. Like, like imagine a map that has like DE style, like that blue, those blue tones, but instead it's like a devilish red, like demon spawn infested yeah. area, like a bright, I, I, I just, I love the art direction, but it's just the gameplay and then the, the choice to go with. Yeah. Not, For me, not around based is. Yeah. I, I, I think there's, there's a few things like this. I actually don't like the art direction that much. I like it less oh, than I thought I was going to. Um, mainly because it's a lot more brown and gray than I was hoping it was going to be. I thought there was going to be a lot more like stuff like crystals like glowing and giving you that like that. I think that's sort of what you're saying of like how, how DE is very bright and saturated. BTW, no and hard blue, feelings, like, just like tired of corporate two, like, really greed to colors, push out right? product that um, clearly don't satisfy this, the consumer. The key colors are the like muddy, reddy brown goes, because dash. of the light of the, of the Personally. Uh, skybox thing. Sure. And, um, and then, and then just sort of like gray shadow. And I, 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 I think that there's room for like new areas, new maps they add to look really cool potentially. Um, but they need to like i just I, I i personally just don't like the brownie gray kind of filter on things that's yeah. it, but I, again that's also i know that that's like that's much more like a personal preference thing like i'm always someone that hasn't ever liked dark maps um like i always like if i could if i could play zombies on a beach or something i would love that yeah. <laughs> like it's just my yeah. my personal preference um but yeah it's it just it feels a bit washed out, I guess, is how I would maybe describe it. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, yeah. I think I think I was more so like in the areas that are bright, but yeah. There, now that I'm thinking about, it, there are a lot of areas that aren't bright. And yeah. So. Yeah. It's like Shinonuma in Chronicles is like. It's 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 actually really interesting what they did with Shinonuma in Chronicles because it's. Couldn't it's fit not this in, but love from of, like, Mercer dark, State, Louisiana. Quite like contrasty, like, contra like <laughs> black and green kind of right tones back. that you have from World at War. But it's actually like I would describe it as like minty white, like like Chronicles Shinonuma. It's right. it's so yeah. bright, and it's got this it's got this feeling almost like your Marshall. What are we doing here? This like heavenly. This is my first like, time watching my stream. I'm in Australia. I think it's, it's gorgeous, 2 a.m. now. So How do good. I upgrade membership? Um, New emojis. This, by comparison, to me, looks significantly worse. Like, the Chronicles 1 looks 
so much better to me personally. But again, I recognize that for some people, the shadowy, like dark, moody aesthetic is more preferable. Um, sure. Yeah. But yeah, I and it, it's it's just like I I I really wish like because honestly, the way with the hardcore zombies community and sure maybe and I was saying this as well, maybe they have data that you know uh outbreak style gameplay gets a way higher player count and that you know it's about they've 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 publicly said that it's um uh even like in the down periods when they're not releasing big updates and stuff uh it's 50 50. Yeah. outbreak has just as many players as round based yeah so i i think i think outbreak is more new players it seems and yep. players that are just more casual like you're just sitting on the couch like not sitting at a desk like you know, with the controller and just able to like run around and just have a casual chill time. Um, it seems like this is not going to even hit that in a certain way because round 15 was super hard. Like, yeah, once you get to round 10, I feel like there's a difficulty jump, which yeah. is just going to shut out like casual players. They're not going to be able to do and, that. And, like, and, the, and the ability to get to round 10 quickly is way faster than it takes to get to round 10 on Outbreak because there's so much side stuff you can do on the lower levels. There's a lot more like time killing stuff. So mm -hmm. I think it I think it's gonna miss the mark on even the casual players because the casual players are gonna, you know, run around like it's one area to run around in and then the rest of it you're just you have to be doing the objective and only the objective. So mm -hmm. you're kind of forced to progress. And yeah. the po the and progress also, is yeah. quick. So they're gonna die faster because they're, you know, newish players and casual players. Yeah. So and you they they, Marshall, they advertise thank you this so whole much, thing bro. like choose the portal uh, you're going go to the next objective or whatever or click the member that button. isn't how it works you get one objective you're just sitting there just doing the one thing that it gives you and it's just like where's my choice i thought i was going to be able thank to choose you, this like isn't, it. wasn't that meant to be the point i maybe i'm maybe i'm wrong maybe i just like misinterpreted the marketing but yeah yeah i i, I mean dude, like for a lot of this, my entire stream has just been spamming boycott. And I, I, I've been trying to tell people, like, I'm not giving it, like, a number rating. I'm telling you, like, what I did like about it, what I didn't like about it, and what my yeah. pre preferences are. Because, like, for some people, I think they're going to love this. Like, I honestly think some people will love this. But it, I think the vast majority don't. But if, if, it's, if this is the kind of thing that, like, you like doing, you like making, like, a little build and doing a little progression, getting to, like, round 15, and then being like okay now i die like if that's the kind yeah. of experience that people like that's totally fine and i think that some people will like this like i didn't really like outbreak at all and some people said it was the best thing that's ever happened to zombies so i mean everyone has different pre preferences yeah yeah i think my my overall takeaway as far as like boycott and that sort of stuff goes is like i am pretty confident that there will be a free weekend for the game at some point within the next two months and i think that if anyone in the chat watching this right now is even hesitating like five percent like if you if what you've seen in in minor noah's streams you're like hell yeah this looks awesome sure jump in right you do you if it's appealing to you then totally fine but if our concerns here raise even the smallest amount of like hesitation for you just don't get the game yet wait till the free weekend then try it and then you will know 100 percent for yourself at that point before you spend like 80 bucks on something that might disappoint you you know what i mean yeah. um i think it's a middle ground where you're not like two years a pitch Anyhow, like, how to oh, membership. Like, get on activision's case like send loads of email angry emails make loads of like da, 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 whatever like it doesn't need to be to that extent but I, I I would Marshall, really urge people bro, if you're buying what are you specifically doing? if you're buying years, the game for zombies. There is no reason. Marshall, it's down to like, like Google it, man. Don't it. donate 180 like, bucks. Waiting a month Marshall's for the goat right now. Marshall, no more. Not, you're no not going to miss serious, anything. You There's off. no Easter egg unsolved you that you can like. You might miss the hunt for. There's not going to be yeah. like. Uh, there's no like transient timed event that is going to end. Like, just wait, right? Yeah, I I. Yeah, I think that's true. The the amount of the amount of content in the game right now you can experience in a free weekend. And yeah. There's. I don't know. It, I don't know. I it, it just. It, I think I think the developers, like, the direction that they chose to go, makes sense on paper, but in reality, it doesn't really. Uh, 
it, do it doesn't really add up because they, they're like oh you know like everyone's been killing zombies in round based game modes for like 10 years what what should we do oh let's mix it up so every single game is different and it's not a static game and like it, it it makes sense on paper to say that right like it's yep. it makes sense to say like oh you're gonna get different covenants and it's all randomized and you're gonna do different objectives like it makes sense how that would sound like it takes the game mode away from this like stale place but yep. honestly i think that stale place is actually the play the where the gameplay is just the best it's the reason people come back and play call of duty every year um right. but the content needs to be added in a way that there are more like on, like i mean it's always just this like make more maps forehead but like that's where the content <laughs> and the development needs yeah. to like be because i like the amount it's the reason custom zombies is still so popular so many years later it's new content every day like, yep and it's also it's it's a, it's a complexity thing where the fact that both of us have had the exact same thought after 15 rounds which is i've seen it all like i've literally seen all the game can offer for for a day one player to say that is so bad and like i was thinking the whole my whole first playthrough right with the covenant system i was like okay this is going to be the most exciting part of the game for me because it's this supposedly roguelike inspired feature where you're going to be able to have like you said totally different experiences to save our between souls, different, different maps like totally different you're going to be able to have one game where you play and you're making like a melee build where like you melee zombies and souls. if there's other zombies like l far away or something then like you'll have some crazy ability where like zombies at a distance will like explode and you can chain stuff together and like there's all these like random ideas right and then the next game it'll be like a gun that you have like like single fire bullets do like extra damage or something and you get more damage if you shoot zombies in the foot or something it's like totally different to, PC overnight to work, the normal so play pretty time that you anyway, the next game will be totally Mardi different Gras, again based me. on your covenants but the problem is that there are 11 covenants two of them are alternate ammo types that okay, we've well, already had dash. in Thanks, years man. gone by <laughs> one of them is uh, uh, you get a little tiny bit of health back from meleeing a zombie one of them is like stand still and you do more damage. Yeah. Like one of them is shoot zombies multiple times to do more damage. It's like they're they're I'm gonna be honest, they're pretty boring, and there's only a handful of them that actually synergize. Like you can get cryo freeze and then do more damage to slowed enemies, yeah. but that is literally just cryo freeze from Cold War. That is literally what cryo freeze did. They split it up and forced you to try and syn synergize its old abilities. Yeah. And. And you only get three of them. Total. And you only get three, and you can't, you 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 can't do anything that actually feels like, oh wow, I've never played zombies like this before. Like, I, I have to say this. I know that this is gonna sound like I'm like, just repeating the same old stuff over and over again. But Hades, there's a reason that I fought so hard in JC's video for that to be like my favorite game of all time or whatever it was. I genuinely think. The system they have in Hades, where they have boons, okay? And chat, if you don't know what that is, it's basically like a covenant. So just think of it like a covenant from Vanguard, okay? You have these boons from different gods that work together to make a really unique playstyle, And it's like those things I was talking about before. One will mean that you do, like, more damage at range, and then you can combine that with something that chains things at range, and maybe there's something that makes it last longer, and it gives it another ability, and it leaves something behind when you use it, or, like, whatever. There's a million and different one boons. Yeah. And the fact that there's genuinely, like, hundreds of them means you can build insane builds, and no play session feels the same yeah. in a row. Like, ever. I, I... This game has tried to do that, and it's just told it we are a year out from it having enough covenants to actually feel like it has that variety and i i would have honestly would have been even more exciting for me in that little like adrenaline rush every time you finish something is if you went up and you bought a permanent upgrade like say you get like three options one's like plus one one percent damage plus two percent headshot damage plus you know three percent uh damage when below half health like yep. that kind of stuff and that kind of stuff stacking so that at the end you're just like a god that yep. is that's that's fun that's more fun than like oh checking my covenants oh there's three of them oh uh, they're all worse than what i have okay i guess i'm done going on to the next round so yeah i mean i i i agree like some 
five. Because uh, also, part of the problem is that there's only three of them. So you get three that you want, and like you, you have an idea in mind, and there's so few of them that you basically have like one or two like metas that, that people are going to choose to do, and that's probably going to end up being about it if you want to actually be able to kill stuff. So you're going to go for one of those metas and just get the same three boons or covenants. You're going to get them to legendary by like round, I don't know, like 15-ish. But then at that point, you're never going to spend your hearts. Like why would, there's nothing to spend them on. They're just going to sit there. You're never going to change. You're not incentivized to change. Like, it, it's like the system doesn't even matter. You know, it's it like, does matter though. Mr. T likes if I'm lurking in this <laughs> Discord call. Oh, no, I was I was about to wait for a whole hour until I could say something, bro. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry, I'm Lex, so hi. upset. I'm <laughs> so upset. I'm livid. <laughs> I, I see you about. lurking this is there. Probably, I think this is my favorite Call of Duty Zombies game they've ever played. You, shut I've, up. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, thank God, I dude. Know, I, I for a minute, you got me good <laughs> there, bro. <laughs> I, yes. I, I would have loved. I would have loved if you actually like did love the game. I do. Um, listen, I do like the game. I'm just like oh. I'm trying to find if there's a meta right now that makes things easier. And I think the meta is almost like there's a Cold War Zombies meta going on where it's like shotguns are like the bread and butter. You know. Mm -hmm. uh, but. Yeah, I agree. The jump from round 10 to 15 is insane. It's like you go from walkers to super sprinters. Uh, Kingman also told me that on round 20, zombies do 100 damage, which yeah. means if you get hit like two, no, three twice. times. Yeah, twice. If you have no armor, that's twice. That's two, yeah. that's two hit down. Yeah. Two hits. Like, that's crazy. Like, I, I don't think anyone's going to get to round 30 anytime soon. It's going to be it, like, I don't know how people are going to do it. I just, I also just don't know why you'd want to. That's true. Like, 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 like with, with, with a normal map, like you, there's like, there's like a progression that goes through. That's like fun. At least, at least what I do that is like fun for me and is like interesting. Um, like, how are you it's, playing it's already? It's like a day of exploring the map, you know? And that's fun. And I actually, I actually would love to see like a week of the map without an Easter egg. Like just like, like if they're gonna do delayed Easter eggs, like literally just do like a week, week delayed Easter egg, release yeah, like, the like Easter egg. Raid. Yeah, release the Easter egg. Have it be this big race, but make it freaking hard. Make it revelations yes. hard. Make it yep. like impossible to solve, and have everybody race and just try that as hard as they can to complete this Easter egg. Um, then after that Easter egg is solved, like, you know, a week later or something like that, it's now been two weeks since the map came out. Now that the Easter egg is solved, now everybody is like learning the speed run. They're learning how to, you know, like beat the Easter egg, like optimization, figuring out side Easter eggs, all this stuff. That now is like three weeks. It has now been like three weeks of like quality, pure content of for like everybody to enjoy not only the youtubers but the viewers and like people who just want to play it's like three weeks uh, this map is now like three weeks rather than 24 hours hashtag lord spreadsheet 789 and, and now it's just more it's less time before the next map comes out like because you know you've, you've already used up so much time so yeah i mean i also i think that they Basically, I think the idea of the Covenant system here to try and give you variety between games is really good because that is something that is lacking in the traditional Zombies loop. Like, when Stop I jump into the a Lord Cold War Zombies match, Bro, Marshall, I'm not you have really Stop. motivated Marshall, to play any differently from the previous match Stop. unless I'm, like, going for camos, which, personally, Stop. I don't care about camos, so I never do that. Stop um, it. Get some help. But Covenants is a really good opportunity to say, well, you can't play it the exact same way every time because it's like a roguelike. It's going to it's gonna give you some element of randomization, but it's still going to be fun no matter what. Um, How are you playing already? I got an early code. It's, it's a noble effort. I know what that'll be. Because all. then Thank again, you, you, so you've got that three weeks Appreciate of content, that. but across the three weeks, you're having different experiences day on day. That would be amazing. But th this is, is like, is the polar opposite, right? Where... We're nowhere. We're we're not going to get to one week with this game. 
Like I, I don't even know if I'm making it to another stream. Yeah, I mean, I want to do co-op. I, I I think co-op would be fun. I definitely want to do some co-ops. Fun. I think we should we should do a co-op for sure. Um, like we should do a four-player co-op with like. Like I agree, this could yeah. be one of those games where I, mean, I was I was saying this before the game launched. It could be one of those games where it's like extinction, where it doesn't even matter about the player count. It's just like the more players, the more damage. Yeah. Output that you have. So yeah, maybe. We yeah, should. And also, I, I'm down to yeah. do a four player run in like like four hours from now, something like that. Yeah. Yeah. In a couple hours, I'd, I will I, be I'd, live like, in four hours. Okay. Let's let's let's, go. let's plan for doing that. We'll grab one more person and we will. We will see what the game feels like in co-op. Yeah, I think Chop yeah. said that he wanted to. I'll have to check DM. I'm, I'm pretty sure that he. Yeah, we'll DM him and we'll we'll, we'll figure we'll it out. We'll do we'll do we'll do a little yeah. four-player run in like say like four four and a half hours from now. Yeah, something like that. Um, I have a feeling this could be a co-op game, like where people are gonna get higher rounds on like four-player than on solo, which is kind of cool. That's different. Maybe. We'll see. Yeah. I, for, for for me, it's just like I my expectations were not high. Like as soon as I read the uh, blog post, my expectations were low. So I'm not like mad or disappointed. I'm just kind of like it's what I expected. So. Right. I, I just yeah I. I I read the blog post and I knew that it was. I, like I knew that it was going to be different and stuff, but. I still thought, I really thought that like covenants would have a bigger impact and like the perk upgrades would have a big, like I just, I'm surprised. I am surprised. Somehow, even though I was keeping my expectations down, I am still surprised. Um, I, I, I just think sad. one of the biggest things I've noticed is you spend a lot of time upgrading in this game, but the zombies upgrade faster than the player does to the point where it's like, yeah, like I had on round 15 like a triple path weapon the best covenants that i could get at that time plus like all the perks maxed and i couldn't kill like two zombies to get out and of the corner and die you can't even take a breather because you can't pause in the solo which is exactly. insane to me yeah yeah i'm wondering if that's a day one patch thing i'm really hoping the no pausing in solo is a day one patch thing because that's mm. i think the day one patch is out oh well yeah like th good. I'm sure they will add it because we will all moan about it. But like, pausing the game, bro. <laughs> like the last time that happened, I'm pretty sure was Exo Zombies. Um, I, I made a big thing about how you couldn't pause in solo, and Michael Condry ended up being like, "Don't worry, I'll get this sorted for you." But like, it's pausing the game. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> you should be able to pause it. Yeah. It, it oh, really man. is. It, I mean, it's just, it's just, it, it just goes to show like how much this like. It's just a common theme. Like, we 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 finally get like server pauses in previous games, and now yeah. we get to this game and we don't even have solo pause. So yeah, now, now that now that can be like a feature that's released. It's and just, exactly, and then it'll be season one. We're introducing pausing. Yeah, like, it's like again for the third time that we're introducing a feature that should be in the game already. Yeah. So I don't know. Anyway, I'm gonna. Stop ranting. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get off stream and uh, I'm down to play later though and we can try it out <laughs> Like I like oh I, I, I don't think it's all bad. I do think that there are some good parts, but overall just not Not something I see as super replayable right now is my that's those are my ba like core thoughts is I just don't see it being very replayable right now Yeah, so yeah, we need a hardcore balancing update at least for like round based progression. I feel like at, like At least for higher rounds because like at this point the round 20 in this game is basically round 50 Oh, it, I think oh, it's I think even far. Yeah. I think it's maybe even yeah. higher. Yeah. yeah, like maybe like round 80 or something it's, I was getting yeah. super sprinters on 14 15 like that. Yeah. I have a ton of health so. Yeah And that's with triple pack as well and they still don't like yeah. Like, yeah, yep. they're still strong sort of thing. Um, yep. This is true. Boys, okay. it's, um, it's going to be an interesting year. Okay. Um, <laughs> yes. 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 Overall yes, yes. thoughts, once again, chat, I see people still asking. I would recommend 
you don't buy the game now you wait for a free weekend in like a month then you give it a try see if you like it while it's free and then if you like it buy it but if you don't then obviously you can wait another six months for the next free or n another two months sorry for the next free weekend and just keep testing it but like the game feels like it's in early access right now there's no point paying for that like if you're not gonna like it you know what i mean so just wait to test it for free i i would say okay bye bye okay <laughs> um I guess I guess my thoughts in contradiction to Milo, I I I think if you if you watched it and it looks fun, there's no reason to not get it. You know what I mean? Like I think you have if you watched it and it looks fun, you're gonna have a blast playing it. If you're if you watched it and you're like, this isn't for me, I don't know about that one, Chief, then don't then don't get like I agree. Wait for the free weekend and uh, it'll it'll give you a better a better idea of you know the game and what you're which you're gonna have fun with and everything like that. Um, like, you know, basically, basically, like, if you if you think if you think Outbreak is good, you are very, very, very much more likely to like this than, um, you know, uh, than round base fans. Uh, that being said, I personally have pretty much no interest in playing it again so if you want my opinion that's my opinion um if, if you see if you see me saying if you like it then buy it as defending uh and like <laughs> the old sucking treyarchs you know what like then you know <laughs> sure dude sure that's what i'm doing but that's that's how that's how i feel about it i'm gonna be playing again later today with the boys Mm. And uh It is what it is, chat. It is what it is. I think we spent just as long discussing as we did playing. So it is what it is. Guys, if you did enjoy, please leave a like. Um please leave a like. I will see you guys a few hours, probably like four hours or so later on today to uh to chat and play uh play with the boys. So Anyway, we'll see y'all in the next one. Thanks so much for tuning in, everybody. Love you all, and peace out.